What's so special about Calgary? Calgary, Alberta is known as the land of the nutty wind. <laughs> I, I, is that an important part of your work, that you are nutty? Does it help to be nutty? Wacky animators, you mean? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think uh, our work is, for want of a better word, sort of humane, you know, that uh, we put a lot of energy into creating characters that are sympathetic and meaningful. The concept for When the Day Breaks was inspired by having lived in big cities, that there are all these wires and conduits that actually connect people, but that everybody uh, lives with hardly knowing their next door neighbor. The actual connection that happens among people isn't always acknowledged until something happens. And the impulse that the uh, pig has when she goes, well, in the scene that we call uh, um, we, we, we all the way home. <laughs> I mean, that's something that's quite real for me, that need to just get home and batten down the hatches when you want to just hide from the world. She tries to shut it out, but finds that she is unable. And that's when she has this vision of traveling through the pipes and wires and seeing the whole city. She realizes a connectivity to other creatures in the city in a very positive way. She, she derives comfort from knowing that there's a, a cow next door doing his ironing and there are people in the subway and that basically the kind of we're all in this together uh, idea. We used kind of an unusual technique to make this film. What we did was first go out and shoot. Using a little home video camera, we would set up the basic action and we used a little thing called a video printer, which creates thermal prints of single frames of the action. And then after that, we would uh, photocopy them and paint using oil sticks on top of those images. Sometimes retaining a little bit of the actual backgrounds, which gives it an interesting dimension in the paint. <laughs> I think animators tend to be more introverted. We tend to like to be alone. We get to be in control of one tiny little production that takes forever. From start to finish, it took about four years to make When the Day Breaks. It was uh, 7,000 7, images. I like imbuing really ordinary objects with some kind of beauty, I suppose, like a toaster, a kettle, a toothbrush, something like that. Yeah, once again, it's sort of taking something that you take for granted and, and bringing attention to it in a way that's kind of unusual. We had a hard time setting the tone at the end so that she wouldn't just sort of say, oh well, <laughs> you know, on with my day, that's, that was too bad. So we wanted her to be changed in a positive way. The campaign for United is definitely a, a fresh approach and, and this is a, an incredible opportunity to have our work seen. We really liked the idea of somebody getting up, grooming, figuring out what to wear. These are intimate close-ups, that, that sort of thing. The exercise in telling that story is actually a really fun challenge. We did the same thing. We went out, we shot live action, and then this time brought it into the computer and selected out specific images and then printed them out, painted them, and then pushed them back into the computer and added color. When we did the commercial, we were doing human characters and we found that it just didn't quite have that transformative quality. It didn't become something else. So what we did was um, in the computer we shifted the features to make them a little bit more stylized thing, just a little bit of exaggeration. That way you engage with the character more easily. We're very glad to work in our quiet environment. I suppose we do feel a little bit like Ruby the pig wanting to just come home and close the door. My own tendency is to retreat and to live in a bubble, but I very much value relationships and community and what is it that humanity actually needs in terms of communication or contact. It's revering what we normally uh, see every day and I want you to think about it or I want you to look at it or you think about yeah. those shoes. Yeah, you think about those shoes, young man, before you go off to that interview. <laughs> you think of goop. goop. <laughs> there are you, very blue, 
Are you missing me too? I'm at ease on the breeze, prairie, prairie Where you go in life is up to you. There's one airline that can take you there, United. It's time to fly. <laughs>